This is a Move Me watch list I promised you guys. It's like what, a week and a half ago. This is my movie watch list for the week of 30 July 2024. And I did wedding centric movies. It's in my um, movie notes playlist. So it's kind of coming on the drama of wedding centric movies. And I named, I think it was 10, one of which I already had movie notes for in the birdcage. So of the remaining nine, we have seven on DVD. So. It's perfect. I don't know about watching one video a day. Um, I might do like a marathon and then space out the movie notes videos. Um, we shall see. So here we go. This is my movie watch list for the week of 30 July 2024. I'm Tannis Corley Leonardi. She, her, hers of Seattle. I'm Tannis Leonardi. She, her, hers of Seattle. These are seven movies in DVD format from my and my family DVD collection. This is in addition to watching YouTube videos per normal. One, The Family Stone, a 2005 film. So this fell into the engagement ring category. The Family Stone is a term used to the engagement ring of somebody else in the family. Somebody wants to use as an engagement ring for themselves. Uh, two, My Big Fat Greek Wedding, 2002 film. I genuinely, I don't think I move. I watched this movie after moving out here when I initially went off to college. I don't think I've watched it since then. I'm over 31 years of age and I was, what, 18 years of age, approximately? Okay. Uh, Meet the Parents, 2004 film. This falls into that category as well. Um, of I haven't watched it in a long time. So this is about families meeting. My Big Fat Greek Wedding is about a non-Greek marrying into a, a Greek family. And so getting to learn about the traditions of a what, Orthodox Greek wedding or something. Okay, The In-Laws, 2003. This is about in-laws getting to know each other. So instead of like the families getting, or the people, families, it's like, well, it's kind of, well, wait, wait, are these the same category? No, I, I did, I did it different. It's, this fell, fell into the category with the birdcage. All right, which is like families meeting. I'm figuring things out. And then here's the in-laws. Uh, Crazy Rich Asians, 2018 film. Singapore. Rich people in Singapore. Okay. Um, Monster-in-law, like that are of Asian descent. Uh, Monster-in-law, uh, 2005 film. The antics of a uh, overbearing and control freak mother-in-law. And then up last, The Wedding Planner 2001. About a person who plans weddings and then, what, falls in love herself? Okay. And this was wedding-centric, made that top category. Monster-in-laws by in-laws. And I think the, the Wedding Planner made the top category as well. Because it's very wedding-centric. Uh, but there's also one that I saw in our DVD collection and thought about was Mamma Mia. Uh, the f yeah, the one with uh, Meryl Streep. And I was like, that's this whole time. They focus on the mom and the mom's story. So while it w it's like one of those ones that's like it's supposed to be wedding centric and then ends up like digressing multiple times throughout the movie. And it's really about putting the mom's story together in the wife's like birth story. So too distracted. At least for that list of ten. I, I, I'd stick with it. Okay. And then I'm doing a bonus here. So click click away if that's just happy week of watching. Uh, for those who I'll do some Olympic games in the newspaper update. So this is the Seattle Times Tuesday, July 30, 2024. And we're gonna head on over to sports. And uh, so the, the medal I covered of Niccolo Martinengi yesterday. So here's the sports section. There's gymnastics stuff. I might, we'll see if I do an in individualized athletic performance contextualization. Like there's Rebecca Andrade of Brazil. Um, that I was like interested in. But they're individual events. I don't, they're just beginning or something like that. So, and they kind of peak starting on like August 1st so I'm like it's not quite picking up so that's why there's a last one in. Um, they did it differently than yesterday so 
Nicola Martin and Geek, that medal I covered, the 100 meter breaststroke, where I pointed out the medal table and Italy only had one medal. It was the first Italy medal, gold medal, at the 2024 Olympic Games in any sport. What? He did it as an individual. I was like, <laughs> I saw an interview online and I was like, oh, yeah, that's right, that's what that one means. All right, so they did something different today. And in the Olympic Games section, so it's black, it's grayscale, black and white today. They actually have a section on gold medalists, which names gold medalists um, outside the United States as well. So Tomas Seishon, Italy's Tomas Seishon men's swimming 100 meter backstroke. And he follows up on a guy in skateboarding in ahead of a man who shall not be named from Romania. And I hear a mirror for some. People can't decide on how to pronounce his name. That's, that's the reason enough for me to exclude him from this channel, right? Okay. And then the metal table. So, uh, Tomas Seishon is a... Sorry. I'm sorry. When I don't like a guy, you know, why do I exclude? Okay. Well, I don't like this other guy either. So this other guy is going to get... Sorry, Ryan Murphy of America. You're getting blocked out by crazy rich Asians. We're working on racial progress. So <laughs> there's a picture of him. So I'm going to block it out with crazy rich Asians. Instead, um, here's the metal table. So if we look at the metal table, there's Italy at the bottom. And you're just squeezing on. They have two gold medals. I have covered 100% of the gold medals <laughs> yesterday, Monday, 29 July 2024, at the 2024 Summer Olympic Games. On this channel, same day. Like, same calendar day. I'm like, <laughs> does that mean my le YouTube legacy is forever entwined with Italy at the 2024 Summer Olympic Games? That's very cool. I, I should put that in my Ital Italy Heritage Travel Trip playlist note to self but yeah so we'll see if i do keep this it looks like i can actually cut out the picture of ryan murphy because the like, the seattle times part is on the left side and he's on the right side so i can just cut it right out okay. um and then keep the other page <laughs> the romanian who shall not be named is like <laughs> she's got i haven't got paper. he got he got two blurbs Did he? Yeah, he got he got mentioned twice. In gold medalists and in elsewhere. Everybody's like, you gotta read it, you gotta read it. So sorry, Mr. Shall I come up with a name with him? No, so nickname for him? Rouge Fox. Rouge Fox. Rouge Speckled Fox. Yes, yeah, speckles. Okay. There we go. So happy week of watching. With some Olympic Games coverage bonus. <laughs>